Hello folks, I'm Steve Judd, professional astrologer with 35 years astrological experience and these are my monthly forecasts for each sign for Zodiac for July 2014, brought to you by the wonderful people at AskTheAnswer.com, the UK's leading chat line and helpline for psychics, mediums, card readers etc and astrologers. Enjoy the reading. And this is the forecast for Pisces for July 2014. Obviously, you still have Neptune and Chiron in your sign, but you know this is beginning to slow down now. Neptune's not really moving forward anymore. There's no sign of what we see as new levels of uncertainty or confusion coming up. Um, there's also uh, nothing like the degree of disorder and, and confusion that was common during, during last month, during June. It does seem that the more you get into July, the more you're going to find that people are going to become more amenable, more open to suggestion, that you're going to be finding that you're getting agreement more and more, and that what was blockages, problems and uncertainties during June becomes more clarity, objectivity and de detachment. You may get knocked back in certain areas, you may not succeed in everything, but you'll be able to deal with it much more than you would have been able to during June. It's a month where increasingly you should find that words like effectiveness and efficiency become more and more the order of the day, and I would expect some type of resolution, some type of clarity becoming more obvious as you get into the second half of this month. The urgency the immediacy of the moment, of the, of the period from April through to June, is going to steadily evaporate. And you should find that the more you get into the end of July, you're going to see yourself as getting a much more broader, larger, and perhaps more detached perspective of the last three or four months, in a way that sees it as a whole, rather than being in the middle and looking out. There's nothing coming up that you need worry about this month. There's no new challenge, difficulties or problems. And everything's beginning to look pretty, I'm not going to say good, but steady, stable, relatively healthy. So if it's working, don't fix it. And as far as July 2014 goes, Pisces, have a relatively low-key month. There you go, folks. I hope that was both interesting, helpful, and a bit of fun as well. You'll find out more about me at my website, stevejudd.com, and I'll be back here at askthenswer.com, courtesy of the wonderful people here, this time next month. Bye.